Kids, it's Aria, and welcome back to Undertale. Now, when we last left off, I was in Snowden. We just got out of the ruins, not way too loud again, and, um, we had our first, like, official boss fight with Toria. So, now, we're gonna get going, and, hi, go Bob! So cute. Um, we're gonna get going through Snowden. I'm gonna talk to some Skelebros, and first I'm gonna use the box. I already know what I'm supposed to use. And tough glove, that's a weapon. So I'm gonna put the spider donut in here and the butterscotch pie. For those of you for those of you who know Undertale, you you guys know. I'm gonna need to hold on to those for later. Um I, Should I hold on to the bandage? It's already been used several times. Uh What do I have currently? The faded ribbon. And I have defense 3 with that, so... Eh. Yeah, I'll throw it away. Hmm. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Sure. All that's attached to the end is a photo of a weird-looking monster. Call me! Here's my number! You decide not to call. Okay, creepy. Let's go. <laughs> Wait. Before we go, I'm just gonna quickly save. And let's keep going. Uh, hi, Snowdrake. Check. Six attack, two defense. This team can be invited to keep a captive audience. Chill out. Ow. You're worse than Sam, you know that? But you know what? I know. You laugh at Snowdrake, it's fun. See? Laugh. Dad was wrong! <laughs> oh god, oh god. Careful. If you want to keep a captive audience, then you should probably, like, not attack them. Okay, let's keep going. Hey guys! So, as I was saying about Undyne... Um... <laughs> and spin! <laughs> Oh my god! It's an act! A human! Um... Uh... Actually, I think that's a rock. Ow! <laughs> hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! Is, is that a human? Yes. <laughs> oh my god! Sons! I finally did it! I'm dying, Will. I'm gonna... I would be so popular! 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 <laughs> Ahem. Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I would... <laughs> Sorry about that. Had some spit in my throat. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then... I'm not sure what what's next. <laughs> in any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Hmm, that's nice of you, Sans. Oh, what's this? Uh, a monster encounter. That's what it is. Ice cap struck with you. Um, check. Ice cap. Attack seven. Defense two. This team wonders why its name isn't Ice Cap. Oh, I just love my hat. Okay. Um. Okay. Oh, oh dear. These are hard. I forgot about these. Um, I'm gonna get new clothes now. Um, ignore. You managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoying. What? What are you doing? Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Make it. Um, ignore again. You continue not looking at Ice Cap's hat. It seems to cheat it. Fine. I don't care. You, you seem to care. Like a lot. Oh, okay. Too close. Ice Cap is just for attention. And steal. You tried to steal Ice Cap's hat and succeed in melting your hand. So cold. Ice Cap is no more. Um, compliment? You bought Ice Cap, but it still looks fine. Yeah, I like my hair too. Ice doesn't mind its identity. So. Yay! <laughs> that was fun. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the wild practice sentry station. 
who could have built this, you ponder? Because it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, it's not yet a very famous royal guardsman. <laughs> okay, Pappy. It, it's very well built. I'll give you applause for that. Absolutely no moving! <laughs> okay. Doggy! Hi. Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again! Okay, th that's kind of rude. Doggo blocks the way. Check! Doggo, six, six attack, one defense, easily executed by movement. How does include squirrels? Don't move an inch! Okay, I won't move. There we go. If you guys are wondering, like, if you haven't played on the show before, Cam is already gonna, like, tell us this, but I figured I might say it now. Blue attacks don't hurt you, so if you just stay still, they won't hurt. Doggo can't seem to find anything. Pet! You pet Doggo. What? I've been pet? Pet, pot, pet, pot, pot, pet, pot, 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 pet. <laughs> Doggo has been pet. This is strange, though. You earn zero XP and 30 gold. This something pet me. Something that isn't m moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Okay. Hi! Hello? Is anybody there? No? <laughs> I'd do that more, but I have a feeling that's gonna take up most of what I'm doing right now. Someone's been smoking dog treats. Not judging. What's over? Hey, Sans. Hey, there's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. See? What I tell you? If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Okay, Sans, can you not with the colors? Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. And that's in yellow! Okay! That's not confusing at all. Okay. North ice, south ice, west ice, east, not in town. And ice. <laughs> oh, hey, Mr. Snowman. Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you could be so kind, traveler, please, take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. I'm gonna hold on to that. When I get back to the box, I'm gonna uh, hold on to it and like put it in the box. That made no sense. Hi! You're so lazy! You were napping all night! Uh, I think that's called sleeping. <laughs> yeah, that's called sleeping packs. Excuses, excuses! Hey guys! Oh ho! The human arrives! In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles! I think you'll find this one quite shocking. Oh my god. Papyrus. <laughs> well, you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Because the amount of fun you will have, you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. I didn't even go on to the maze yet, and Papyrus got zapped. Sans! What did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, paps, 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 paps. Hold this, please. Paps, you, 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 you kind of look. You, you, you. Okay, try now. You, you, you kind of like your footprints, but I get shocked if I end up touching the walls. Oopsie. <laughs> Incredible, you slippery snarl. You solved it so easily. Too easily. That, that's because you can't make the footprints. Um. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother, Sands. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> did he just... Did he just slid away? <laughs> hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? He made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. Keeps going in his bottle body. It's 
that's cute. Man, isn't my brother cool? Poppy is very cool. He's exceedingly cool. Hey, nice cream guy! I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Oh! A customer! Hello! Would you like some nice cream? It's the frozen treat that warmed your heart. Now just 15G. Sure! Here you go. Have a super duper day. You got the nice cream. Yay! Nice cream! Nice cream, nice cream. I yeah, love the nice cream. Okay. This. This is it. If you guys play, I, I'm gonna tell you, you know how annoying this puzzle can be. Come on. Okay. Stop. I'm gonna make it so I can get some points and I haven't even moved from the first area. Down. Hi, Sans. I will talk to you in a minute. <laughs> no! Come on. I am sucking at this. Come on. Please. No. Don't. Don't shrink. Oh, it's almost there. No. No. Don't shrink. Don't shrink! Purple, even when you felt trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of the ball. You are awarded 2G. Oh, come on, really? It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow -cudron. I don't know how to pronounce that. <laughs> All of you Undertale fans, get triggered. I've been thinking about selling treats, too. Want some fried snow? It's just 5G. Sure. When I say 5G, I meant 50G. I have 50G. Really? How about 500G? I don't have that much, but let's see if we can do it. 5,000G. Wait. 50,000G! That's my final offer. Okay, um. Let's keep going. I don't have the money, but. What? You don't have the money? Hey, that's okay. I'm having this now. Try to bribe the little kid. You should get shaving yourself. Right. <laughs> His. Hers. Smell danger lady. Snow, smell, snowman. White bearding can become a yellow lady. I'm suspicious smell. Puppy. Green lady. Smell is very wrong. Weird smell human. Green lady. Destroy at all costs. Why is the green and red? <laughs> What's with all the confusion? It's not cool. Okay, let's keep going. Human! I hope you're ready for. Silence! Where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. <laughs> A word search? Okay. <laughs> um. Sans. This is so silly. I, I, I can't. I'm sorry. I, I can't. Sans! That didn't do anything! Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that! In my opinion, Junior Jumbo is easy, easily the... Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Junior Jumbo is easily the hardest. What? Really, dude? That easy be the word scramble? Put some baby bones. Unbelievable. <laughs> Human! Solve this dispute! Which is harder, jumble or crossword? Uh, I've never done either. Um, jumble. Ha! Ha! Yes! Humans must be very intelligent, and they also find Junior Jumbo so difficult. Yeah! <laughs> hey, Sans. No hard feelings, right? Thanks for saying Junior Jumble just to appease my brother. Yesterday he got stuck trying to solve the horoscope. <laughs> I want to see what happen. Yay! Another save point. Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. Thanks, Ari. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy the spaghetti. This is doing now. This spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you are progressing. You're only jumped again by the great Papyrus. Yeah, <laughs> Papyrus. <laughs> I love spaghetti. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. Aww. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. Aww! 
spaghetti though. It's an unblown microwave. All the settings say spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, something you don't actually get able to eat the spaghetti because, well, you do eventually, but I want to try that spaghetti. I love spaghetti. Huh? There's a camera hidden inside this tree. Alphys, are you watching me? Warning, dog marriage. Oh god. I remember this one. Anything behind this tree? Nope. But uh, there is an encounter. Bless your dog! Aww. Check. That's a dog. Attack 7, defense 0. Wields a stone do dogger made of pomegranate. <laughs> granite. <laughs> no, leave me alone. <laughs> Annoying dog. Leave me alone, please. Cat. You barely lift your hand unless the dog's out of sight. Tiny bark. Oh, hey! How was I supposed to get past that? Mr. Dog is bugging inside of Pet more. You already touched the dog. It's already over inside Can't pant. Leave me alone. Mr. Dog is barking inside of you. I'm a pet until its head like goes out of the box. How am I supposed to move past that? Pet more. You pet the dog. It was a good dog. Excited noises. <laughs> No, leave me alone. That's how. Okay. Let's see, dog is not me. I want its head to leave the box. You pet the dog. It's pet the nose, no doubt. Excited voices. Go away. Let's see, dog is not me. Come on. Keep petting. Critical pet. Dog is petting in pieces. Excited noises. Oh. I don't think. Does this dog attack me now? You have to jump up to pet the dog. No, it doesn't. <laughs> okay. Come on, you don't even pet it. It gets more excited. Plane take off. <laughs> Come on, there's no way to stop this madness. <laughs> Cat whistle. Come on. This dog shows no signs of stopping. I just want his head to leave the box. This dog enters the realm of clouds. Bye. Okay. You call the dog, but it's too late. It cannot hear you. Far away bark. Yay! I got his head to leave the box. Okay. Now we can He earned 0 XP and 20 gold. Now we can continue. There's a switch hidden in the snow. Click. Okay. I think that opened up someplace over here. Maybe. Yep. Because the way to open it was blocked off by snow. I wonder if Papyrus or the dogs did that. Okay, on to the next boss fight. Hello, doggies! What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. Here's that word smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! That's not very nice. Dog guy, I saw you. Dog me. Um. Check. Dog me. Attack six. Defense four. Husband of dog Ressa. Knows only what he smells. Don't touch my hot dog. He needs me. <laughs> oh. 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 Ow. There we go. Yay! The dogs are practicing the next couple of contests. Aww. So cute. Okay. Um. Roll around. You roll around in the dirt and smell. You smell like a weird puppy. Let's kick human tail. Do humans have tails? Probably not. I, um... I don't have a tail. I, I, I don't. <laughs> dog you want to be smelly. Um... Dog Ressa, you stick. The dog sniff you again. After rolling in the dirt, you smell alright. What? Smells like a... Are you actually a little puppy? Okay, don't, don't get hit. Ouch! Shouldn't have moved. Ow! Owie! Okay. Nice cream. Wait! No! Oh, God. Okay. That was an accident.
Um, I might have to go back and get another snowman piece. I was in such a hurry, I didn't... Oh, God. That was... I is a screw-up. I is a screw-up. That was so stupid of me. Come on. I just pet you, dog of me. Mm. There you go. Hopefully I'll be able to get back to the... Oh, sorry about that. Wow, the world has been opened up to us. Um, pet by another pup. Pet by another dog. Thanks, weird puppy. Okay, I'm gonna head back and see if I can get another snowman piece. Or I might just have to do all that again. I I'm not saving. I don't want to, like, permanently make that a thing. Hopefully, I'll, I'll just say that I lost it. Hopefully, because that was an accident. <laughs> I so did not mean to do that. I didn't even notice. I was looking for nice cream, and as soon as I saw snow, I'm just like, oh, nice cream. Uh, please don't be mad, please don't be mad, please don't be mad. How am I doing? And my arm, the piece I gave you. Huh? You lost it? I suppose I can give you another piece. Please be careful this time. Oh, that's not. Thank you! Oh my god! Okay, as soon as I get to Snowden, I'm putting that right in the box. Oh, <laughs> that was such a screw up of me! I cannot believe I actually did that. That was an accident. A complete and total accident. Okay, pass the crossword and save. Okay, let's go. I didn't mean to do that! Why did I do that? Okay, Aria. Note to self. Read before you select some- Oh no! Not Jerry! <laughs> Ice Cap and Snowdrift confront you, sighing Jerry. Oh. Okay. Jerry, attack zero, defense 20. Everyone knows Jerry. Makes attacks twice as well. You have the still naked. What? Why are you doing this? What the? Oh! Oh no! Why? Why? <laughs> How did I not die to that? Come on, um, ditch! You and the other ones to ditch Jerry when it gets away. You have the still naked. I found the snow poppy. Oh my god, Snow Drake! <laughs> like I said, it's funny when Sans does it, but when other people do it, it's just. Cringe! Oh god. Uh, oh! Oh my god! Okay, spare you. Oh no! Why are you back? Ow! Come on. Oh god. No, why is Jerry back? Ditch! Again! Go away! I just love my hat. Yeah, I know. Can we finish this that way I can, like, ignore your hat? So that way Jerry doesn't come back? You have to take your eyes away from Ice Cap Pat. It looks annoying. What? What are you doing? Okay. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ice Cap is secretly checking to see if you're looking at the pad. I'm not. Ignore. It's a secret. But. Oh, why are you back, Jerry? Ow. Can I. Okay. Fair. Awkward. Can you leave? Ditch, you only lost it just Thank you! <sighs> I don't like Jerry. He's annoying. Turn every X into an O, then press the switch. Oh. Hi, Papyrus! What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? I need some Papyrus about his spaghetti. Left it. Really? Wow, we. You resisted the flavor of my home cooked pasta just so you could share it with me? Fright not, human! I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want! <laughs> yeah. Oh, he's so cute! <laughs> Papyrus is the only innocent person in Undertale. 
Hey, Pappy. My brother started a sock collection recently. How sad, man. Sometimes, I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. <laughs> oh, this puzzle. I know an easy way to finish this puzzle. There's a switch on the tree. Yes. Um, I gotta do that a couple times because I'm not... Last time I did this, it took forever. So I'm just doing... Human! Hmm, how do I share this? You are taking a long time to arrive, so... I decided to improve this puzzle. My radio the snow to look more... Excuse me again, I am so burpy today. My radio the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different! And, as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I'm saying is... Worry not, human! I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Oh, yay. <laughs> wow, you solved it! And you did it all without my help! Incredible! I'm impressed. You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. Yeah! <laughs> Uh, yeah, passionate about puzzles. Sure thing, Pap. I just... Hey, Sans. I just... I know cheats. <laughs> Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Yeah, I know you did. <laughs> you lazy bones. Okay, next puzzle. Hey, it's the humor. You're going to love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alphys. See? Alphys! You see these tiles? Once I throw the switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impossible. You cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. I feel like for future references, I should be writing this down. But I have nothing to write it down on. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Room tiles are water tiles. Swim through them if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. This is why piranhas. Like, couldn't you get like goldfish or like the clownfish? Like get Nemo. <laughs> but why piranhas? Mm. Okay. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Great. Water and electricity do not mix. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They do not do anything. Step on them all you like. How was that? Understand? Understand the explanation. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, I, I understand. Great. Then there's one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been see seen before. Not even I know the solution. Yeah, <laughs> get ready. Oh god. Um, is it gonna stop? Oh, uh, okay. Um. um. <laughs> Bye. Bye, Paps. Uh, that was a waste. <laughs> the machine isn't working. <laughs> Actually, that spaghetti from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, next year he'll even make something edible. Don't say that about Pappy. Look at all these snow dogs. Seems like the base of a snow dog. It's the broken head of a snow dog. It seems like the base of a snow dog. Okay, those are all gonna say the same thing, aren't they? On the floor inside is a box of papa raisins. <laughs> Puns, aware of dog. Please pet dog. 
Knowing that the dog will never give up trying to make the perfect snowman, it fills you with determination. Save me. Hi! A dog just rushed in here, filled with inspiration. It kept trying to build a small dog that expressed its own emotions. But as it built, it kept getting more excited about the sculpture. The neck got longer and longer, and it added more and more snow until it was rather sad to watch. But I couldn't turn away. Oh, poor snow dog. This puzzle I know. Wee! Ice levels. Ice puzzles. Normally I hate ice levels, but this puzzle is easy. Wee! Nice. Okay, what am I gonna come up with? Oh, I have a little snow house on my head. Okay. Hey, Sans. What's up? Those eyes are following me. Say, are you following me? No. I should have known. Griff, gift trot. Um, undecorate. You remove a small, confused dog. That's a little better. Oh god. <gasps> How did I do that? <laughs> Gift Trot is slightly less irritated. Undecorate. You remove the shift pin that says I use the time to move off. That's a little better. Ow! Come on. Okay, there we go. So you're irritated. And undecorate. You remove the stocking filled with chicken nuggets. That's a great gift. Oh, wait, has been lifted. Gift tag problems have been taken away. Bye! You earn 20 X... 20... Not 20 XP. 20 gold and 0 XP. I already know it's back there, but for... For viewers' sakes, I'm gonna head over and show you guys what truly is back here. It's a door. It's a door that's locked, and I'm gonna try my best to unlock it, but then again, the way to unlock it is really hard. If you played Undertale before, you know what I'm talking about, and if you're new, then I'll show you once we reach the end. Ooh, snow puffs. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. This, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is this really a snow puff? Behold! A snow puff! Eh? There's dirty jeans on this. What is this? <laughs> Little confuzzled there, Ari? What a tiny dog has. Wolf. <laughs> Cute! That's not a tiny puppus. That, that's anything but a tiny puppus. It's greater dog. So cute! Greater dog. Attack six, defense four. It's so excited that it just been finding his plane. Oh, that's scary. I know! I forgot what to do with that one! Ouchie! Okay, this time do not eat the snow piece. Eat the nice cream. Have a wonderful day! Your HP was maxed out. Don't move. This one I know I'm not supposed to move when my dog is sleeping. Greater dog is watching you attack. Uh, Beckon, you call the greater dog. It bounced towards you, collecting throttle under your face. Oh, I love puppies! I love puppies! I have my own puppies! You guys remember Baxter, right? He's like, oh, he's so cute! I love puppies. Um, should I, I play right first? It's not exciting enough to play with. That's kind of hard to believe. But either way, I have a little tail wag in the back! Ah, it's so cute! Your dog curls up in your lap as you pet, as it is pet by you. It gets so comfortable and falls asleep. Then it wakes up! It's so excited! Oh god. Woo! Okay! Your dog is patting with the ground from pause. Pause. 
I can't speak. Wait, do you make a snowball throw? I'm going for the dog to fetch. It splats to the, on the ground. Greater dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. And now dog is very tired. It rests on your head. It rests his head on you. I'm so cute. Greater dog wants some TLC. Um, pet. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight onto you. Your movement slows. But you still haven't pet enough. Come on! Just look at his face! And the song! You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog walks over with his legs hanging in the air. Oh, so cute! You earn 0 XP and 40 gold. Aww. Oh, he was a little bubbles after all. So cute. Oh, so cute. Oh, I love the monsters in this. The doggies. They're just so cute. Ah, it's so cute. Okay. After this bridge, we'll make it to Snowden. Oh, hey, Pops. Human. This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlets of deadly terror. Oh. Um, oh dear. When I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will swing, nades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down. Only the tiniest chance of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to do it! Um, nothing's happening. Well, what's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I'm... I'm about to activate it now! There's nothing happening. Um, that, uh, doesn't look very activated. Well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards! <laughs> my puzzles are very fair, and my traps are expertly cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Away it goes. Uh, bye. The doggo. I could have taken the doggo. Ooh, excuse me. Phew. What are you looking at? This is another decisive victory for Papyrus. Yeah. Heh. Heh. Um. Okay. <laughs> I wanted the doggo. Can you convince Pap to give me the doggo? I don't know what my belly's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understand blue attacks. Oh, speaking of doggo. Hi, Maxie! Hi! My dog's in here now. Hey, Bubbles! <laughs> He's just walking around in my room, sniffing everything. And we made it to Snowden! Woo! Welcome to Snowden! The shop. The sight of such a friendly town fills you with determination. Yay! I made it to Snowden! Okay, now I'm gonna put the snowman piece in here. That way I don't end up screwing everything up. Hi, Bubbles. Hi! <laughs> Sorry, dog was in here and I'm just like completely enamored. Hi, Bubbles. Yeah. Love you, Stinker. So cute! <laughs> Save again. And let's go to the shop. Hello, traveler. How can I help you? Um, bye. What would you like to buy? Um, manly bandana that's. Armor Defense 7 has four. It has abs on it. Thank you. Um, I'm gonna buy some bicycles. And then two cinnamon buns. Talk. Say hello. Hiya! Welcome to Snowden! I can't remember the last time I saw a fresh face around here. Where'd you come from? The capital? You don't look like a tourist. Are you here by yourself? What did you do here? You wanna know what to do here in Snowden? Groovies has food, and the library has information. If you're tired, you can take a nap at the inn. It's right next door. My sister runs it. And if you're bored, you can sit outside and watch those wacky skeletons do their thing. There's two of them. Brothers, I think. They just showed up one day and asserted themselves. The town has gotten a lot more interesting since then. Think back to your history class. Um, I, I never studied monster history before. Um, a long time ago, monsters lived in the ruins back there in the forest. 
Long story short, we all decided to leave the ruins and head for the end of the caverns. Along the way, some fuzzy folk decided they liked, they liked the cold and set up camp in Snowden. Oh, and don't think about trying to explore the ruins. The door's been locked for ages, so unless you're a ghost or can burrow under the door, forget about it. I just came from there. I wish I could tell you that. Your life. Life is the same as usual. A little claustrophobic, but we all know deep down that freedom is coming, don't we? As long as we got that hope, we can grit our teeth and face the same struggles day after day. That's life, ain't it? Okay. Now I can go. Bye now. Come again sometime. Okay, I should have enough. Let's. Info. Immediately bandana. Armor defense seven. It has. It has. It has seen some wear. It has abs drawn on it. <laughs> it's so cute. Um. Use. You equip the manly bandana. Item. Okay. Um. I'm gonna put everything. I'm gonna put the faded ribbon in here. Bless me. There we go. Let's go. The inn. Welcome to Snowden Inn. The Snowden Inn. Snowden is premier hotel. One night is 80G. I think I have enough. Yeah, I do. Here's your room key. Make sure to bundle up. Um. Oh. Um. Um. You're snoring. Hey, you look like you had a great sleep, which is incredible because you were only up there for about two minutes. Here's your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. Okay. Mom says that sleeping can recover your health can recover your health above maximum maximum HP. What's maximum HP? That's right! Hey, I got 30 now! I'ma save. Just in case if I die. <laughs> okay, let's keep going. Let's talk to everybody first though. Isn't my little cinnamon look just the cutest? Bun buns are so adorable. See? <laughs> oh. That lady over there. Something about her disturbs me. Hello! Off its hands turned into the local monster by decorating it with, decorating its tree like horns. So we started giving that monster presents to make it feel better. Now it's a tradition to put presents underneath the decorated tree. Hey, that's tradition up above too! And hi, monster kid! Yo! You're a kid too, right? I can't I can tell because you're wearing a striped shirt! <laughs> That's cute. This town doesn't have a mayor, but if there's ever a problem, a skeleton will tell a fish lady about it. That's politics! So, Papyrus will tell on Dine? Or Sans will tell on Dine? I don't know who. Hey, Groby! <laughs> no matter where I go, it's the same menu, the same people. Help! I want new drinks and hot guys! You and me too. You and me too. Hmm. Isn't human food different from monster food? It does things like spoil. And when you eat it, it passes all the way through your whole body. Disgusting. I'd love to try it sometime. <laughs> hey, doggies! We're sentries, but we never get any respect. I wish those skeletons would throw us a bone. We love bones. You better watch when you sit down in here, kid. Because that big guy will jump into your lap and give you lots of love and attention. Aww! I love lots of love and attention! The doggies are so cute. I'm thinking of giving a spike collar to show off my personality. It makes a statement like, attach a leash to me and take me for a walk, please. <laughs> Hi, doggo! <laughs> Those dogs are a part of the Royal Guard, the elite military group led by Undyne. She's rude, loud, and beats up everybody who gets in her way. It's no wonder all the kids want to be like her when they grow up. <laughs> I put I put out a line for some girls today. Someone told me that there are plenty of fish in the sea. Well, I'm taking that seriously. 
I'm literally going to make out with a fish. No judgment here, bud! You look like a fish, so I guess you're attracted to the fish. It's playing poker against itself. It appears to be losing. That takes talent. Hey, Grilbs! Grilbs said that he'd offer you a glass of water, but he doesn't touch the stuff. Aw, oh, that's nice of you, Grilbs. The capital's getting pretty crowded, so I've heard they're going to start moving here. Hmm, I don't want to see the, in see the erasure of our local culture, but I definitely want to see some city slickers slip on their butts. <laughs> I'll want to see that, too. The jukebox is broken. Okay. See you guys! I'll be back later with Sans. Everyone is always laughing and cracking jokes, trying to forget our modern crisis. Dreariness, crowding, lack of sunlight. I would join them, but I'm just not very funny. We all know the underground has problems, but we smile anyways. Why? We can't do anything, so why be morose about it? Huh. Nice coping ability. Coping ability. I can't speak. You're not gonna make me be the human again, are you? Let's play Monsters and Humans! What's not being a human? I'm a human. What are you talking about? Ah, uh, to be young again. The world sure felt balanced. Ah, uh, the beautiful knock. Maybe if I don't answer, I'll hear it again. Yeah, no. <laughs> Hi, Ice Wolf! <laughs> You're the one who puts all the ice cubes in the water. Oh, okay. So, I know where that's heading next. And, yeah. The library sign is spelled wrong. Library B. <laughs> There's an extra B. Welcome to the library. Yes, we know. The sign is misspelled. First time I played this, I didn't know that, so I'm just like, wait, what? It's misspelled? And then I went out and I'm like, <laughs> there are two Bs! Hello. That look in your eye. You're someone that has difficulty solving Junior Jumbo, aren't you? How'd you get that? I love working on the newspaper. There's so little to report on that we just fill it with comics and games. Aww. Cough, cough. <laughs> when I was younger, my teachers gave me word searches when they ran out of assignments. I thought they were a waste of time. But look at me now. I'm the number one word search creator in the entire underground. That's awesome! Monster History Part 4. Here in the humans no longer, we moved out of our old city, home. We braved harsh cold, damp swamp land, and sur and searing heat until we reached what we now call our capital, New Home. Again, our king is really bad at names. <laughs> Asgore? It's a school report about monster funerals. Monster funerals, technically speaking, are cool as heck. <laughs> when monsters get old and kick the bucket, they turn into dust. At funerals, we take that dust and spread it on the person's favorite thing. Then their essence will live on in that thing. Uh, am I at the page minimum yet? I'm kinda sick of writing this. <sighs> Me. Well, monsters are mostly made of magic. Human beings are mostly made of water. Humans, with their physical forms, are far stronger than us. But they will never know the joy of expressing themselves through magic. They'll never get a bullet pattern, birth bullet pattern birthday card. Okay, I don't think I want one, but okay. Here I am, writing this book. A person comes in and picks up the book. They start reading it. Oh, sorry. I, I'm still writing that one. Oh, you were talking! <laughs> because they are made of magic, monsters' bodies are attuned to their soul. If a monster doesn't want to fight, its defenses will weaken. And the crueler the intentions of our enemies, the more their attacks will hurt us. Therefore, if a being with a powerful soul struck with the desire to kill... Um, let's end the chapter here. Don't worry, guys. I'm not doing genocide. Did it once, and only once. Not again. It's a mailbox of the floor with unread junk mail. That's Sansa's, isn't it? The mailbox is labeled papyrus. Look inside? Yes. It's empty. Aw, poor Babs. Oh, right. I almost forgot. It's locked. I gotta find a way to get in there. I never found a way to get into that part of the house before, but I'm eager to get to it. It's locked. From the inside. Okay, let's get started. Next fight, Papyrus.
<laughs> it's really snowy over here. Hey, Paps! Human, allow me to tell you some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another's puzzle solving skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings. It must be what you are feeling right now! Mm, maybe. I mean, I am happy that I found another pasta lover. I'm not all that great at puzzles, but these are fun. And. Hmm. What else? I think you're cool. And I know that you think I'm cool. So. <laughs> I can hardly imagine what it must feel like to be that way. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll believe that. After all, I am very great. I don't even ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. Aw, Pabs! I pity you, lonely human. Worry not! You should not be lonely. You should be lonely no longer. I, the great Papyrus, will be your... No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human! I must capture you! Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream! Powerful, popular, prestigious! That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Royal Guard! Okay, let's keep going then. Hey, Paps! Check. Papyrus, eight attack, two defense. He likes to say, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> These aren't hitting me, Paps. Papyrus is going. Flirt! What? Flirting? So you finally do your ultimate feelings. Yes! Papyrus! I love you! <laughs> well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. I can make spaghetti. Oh no! You're meeting all my standards! I guess this means I have to go on a date with you. Yes, please! Let's date! Let's date later, after I capture you! Yes, please! Date with a skeleton. <laughs> Paris is thinking about what to wear for his date. Um... There. So you won't fight. Then, let's see if you can handle my favorite blue attack. Okay. I I'm gonna try, like, I can't, like, no matter what I do, I can't dodge all those. Eh. You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> First time I played this, that got me. And I was just like, wait, what? <laughs> Why am I blue? <laughs> there goes blue gravity. Hmm. Wonder what I should wear. Harry stabs some bone cologne behind his ear. <laughs> you don't have ears. What? I'm not thinking about the date thing. One second, guys, we'll be right back. Longer to jump higher. Jeez. I'm trying. Come on. Eh. 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 Hey! <laughs> Barry has MTT brand fishy coon behind his ear. What even is that? Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Yeah, please go. Ow. Oh, okay. Crap. There. I still bug not too much feet. MTT Pyrus Dab's MTT brand anime powder behind his ears. I wonder if 
outfits inspired that. <laughs> I can almost touch my future popularity. Eh. Eh. Why did I do that? Oh, okay. Okay. Papyrus Jones, MTG brand. Cute views behind his ears. He doesn't have ears! Papyrus has the royal guard. Oh, ow. Okay. Attraction slime. I'm not even gonna ask why MTC has all those brands. I'm gonna to get a tour. <laughs> Come on. Beauty yogurt. Medicine. Why? Why do you have so many of these? And crap, why did you buy all of them? I'm gonna be really, really proud of me. Uh, Ow. Come on. Uh. Uh. Okay. This is a lot harder than it looks. Sorry for less than you guys have ears. Thank you. Finally, you don't have ears. Okay, well, turn my head in the shape of my smile. Um, okay. <laughs> Gosh, ow. That should be kind of funny. <laughs> my brother will. No, she won't change very much. Ah! Sans out. Come on. Okay, need to heal. Need to heal. Um. Bicycle. Get a one half of bicycle. Your HP was maxed out. I have lots of admirers, but. Ouch. Eh. Ah! <laughs> Escape by the skin of my teeth. Papyrus is rattling his bones. Will oh, anyone like me as sincerely as you? Um, no. no I, 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 I'm, I'm the one who likes you more, Papyrus. Ow, Jake! Okay. Ooh, okay. Papyrus is Catholic. Someone like you is really rare. <laughs> yeah, I know. Ow, Jake! I need to eat something else. The HP is messed up, and dating might be kind of hard. Don't worry. Ouch. All you gotta do is, like, make me laugh. Ouchie! Why did I jump into that? That was so stupid of me. Are you onto your couch and sent away? Can you finish your sentences so that way I can, like, <laughs> like, push me a lot faster? Not on these bones. Oh, who cares? Give up! Uh, no! I'm determined! I'm determined to have that date! Ow. Give me a second. Give up! I'm afraid for my special attack! Uh, uh, I will. Ow, Jake! <laughs> Come on. I am so close to finishing this. Put the bones there. Yeah, I'm very soon I will use my special attack! Papyrus is trying very hard to play it cool. Not too long, and I will use that special attack. Please use it now, Paps. Please. Ow. Use it now, please. What? Oh no. Eat Master Table. This is your last chance to perform my special attack. Thank you. Now I can finally get past this and actually have a debate with you, and then like move on so that I can talk to. Oh, I died! You know what? I know I'm going to finish this. Um, so, behold, my special attack! Thank you, puppers! What the heck? That's my special attack! Hey, you stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey, what are you doing? Go back here with my special attack! Don't go doggo stupid, doggo are cute! Oh wow. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Pass it in ready for a regular attack. This is an absolutely normal attack. Oh god. No. Ouchie! Uh, 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 ow! Uh, uh, ow! I am just taking all the damage and all the hits. Hello, purple! Cool! Dude! You are! Ouch! No! Ow! 
much. Oh, oh that sucked. Eh. You be done now, Paps. I am like at such low HP. Uh, it's cool, you can't uh, defeat me. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Actually, might be because I'm at 4 HP. <laughs> Therefore, I, the great Papyrus, elect to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now is your chance to accept my mercy. Yes, spare. Thank you. Oh, God. Yo ho ho. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. And then I'm going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend quantity will remain stagnant. Oh, Poor Paps! Let's be friends. Yeah, I won't be friends. Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess. I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wow, we we haven't even had our first date, and I've already managed to hit the friend zone. <laughs> Who knew that all I needed to do to make pals was to give people off the puzzles and then fight them? You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to grab pass through. And I'll give directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Like you! That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with the soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is... well... He's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I am certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer. Can I please go home? He'll guide you right through the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talk. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. <laughs> Bye, Pops. I'm gonna head back. Because I need to save, and then I need to, like, up my HP. <laughs> Don't worry, Paps. I'm gonna I'm a have that date with you in just a sec. I just need to save, get my HP all the way back up. I'm gonna buy some more food because I'm low on healing items. Yep, I only have two left. Yeah, I need to buy some more healing items. How much gold do I have? Not one. Okay, this is one. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna buy some more healing items. And I know there are gonna be a lot more fights up the road, so. I need more! Give me more food, please! Thank you! Thank you. It's all saved. And shortcut back to Papyrus's. Woo! Let's have that date! So you came back to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. Yes, I am! I have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Okay, where are we going? Okay, walking, walking, walking. Are we going to grow this? Okay, never mind. Um, library? No. My house! <laughs> okay. I like this place. This is my brother's pet rock. A pet rock. Um... No judgment. Secretly judging. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. I don't know what rocks eat, but I'm pretty sure it's not sprinkles. You touch the couch. It makes a jangling sound. You find a bunch of loose coins in the couch. You got 20. Yay! Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program. MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me! I won't. It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sons! Please pick up your sock! Okay. Don't put it back down! Move it! Okay. You moved it two inches! Move it to your room! Okay. And don't bring it back! Okay. It's still here! 
Do you need to say not to bring her back to my room? Forget it! Okay. <laughs> you guys are silly. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Yeah. Inside a joke book is a quantum physics book. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics book is another joke book. You look inside. Excuse me, there's another quantum physics book. You decide to stop. <laughs> uh, science jokes. My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he's had bacon or something. It was like a quiche, but it filled with sugary, non eggy substance. How absurd! A pie? <laughs> That's the trash can. Feel free to visit it anytime. I wonder what pie he tried to make. Like, I know a lot of people who ship Sorio probably were thinking that um, he made butterscotch pie, but I'm not sure. And personally, I hate Sorio. I don't ship it at all. <laughs> Aha! Interested in my feud museum? Please, pursue, pursue my culinary art show. Half the fridge is filled with containers all day with spaghetti. The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. <laughs> I can tell who those belong to. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can put more bones underneath. Take a look, see. Hi, Popo! What? Catch that meddling canine! Uh, sorry, I couldn't. Curse it! Oh my god, fans. Sons! Stop lagging my life with incidental music! <laughs> Sands. Oh my god. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. The door is locked. That's Sands' room. That's my room. If you're finished looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. Go inside? Yeah. I'm a child, so any of you dirty mind people? Um, no. <laughs> I'm going in here to talk, and hang out, and be nice with my new skeleton boyfriend. <laughs> hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday, even though it basically just happened. The internet! I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away from a double-digit follow account. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous straw has been has besieged my online persona. Always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. I think I know who's doing that. <laughs> That's my bed. If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. Ah, yes. Action figures. A great reference for the theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa. You still believe in Santa? Oh, Papyrus, you're adorable. <laughs> um, isn't that flag neato? I'm done found it at the bay. I just think it's, I think it's from the human world. Yeah, looks like a pirate flag. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? That's a skull and crossbones. It's a pirate flag. It used to belong on a pirate ship. That's why. Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. <laughs> um, well, we have skeletons in our bodies. I don't know how to... Okay, um... I don't know how to explain that. Like, if you feel my body, like, if you feel my hand, and you can feel those hard things, those are bones. And if I do the same thing to you, like, feel your hand, you, it'll feel the same, only mine just has skin and organs over them. That book's one of my favorites. Event Puzzle Construction for Critical Minds. The next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with Fluffy Bunny. The ending always gets me. <laughs> There are no skeletons in my closet! Except me sometimes. Look inside the closet? Yeah. Clothes are hung up neatly inside. You should teach me how to do that, because whenever I end up having to put stuff in the closet, it ends up going all over the floor. So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start the date? Yes. Okay! Dating start!
dating start! Here we are, on our date. I've actually never done this before. But don't worry, you can't go prepared without several letters from my name. I should have an official dating rule book from the library. We're all we're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one, press the C key on your, on your keyboard for dating hub. Wednesday. Yeah, I'm recording this on Wednesday, guys. Wow, we! I feel so informed! Egg population related in Wednesday, then. No, no! I think we're right for step two! Step two, ask them on a date. Ahem! Human! I, the great Papyrus, will go on a date with you! Yes! Really? Wow, we! Aw, so kawaii! So, so kawaii! <laughs> so cute! I guess that means it's time for part three! Step three, put on nice girls to show you care. Wait a second. What? Wear clothing. Yeah, I'm wearing a striped shirt. That bandana around your head. Um, well, yeah, but um, I'm wearing a striped shirt. I know that's either a jumper or like two. I'm, I'm not sure. You're wearing clothing right now! I told you that. Earlier today, you were also wearing clothing! No. Could it be? You won't stake me from the very beginning! You know what? Yeah! Let's, let's go with that! Oh my god, his eyes. No! You planned it all! You're way better at dating than I am! Actually, in real life, I'm not. <laughs> no! Your dating power! Oh. And why not? Don't think you've questioned me yet! I, the great Papyrus, have never been beating at dating, and I never will! I can easily keep up with you. You see, I, too, can wear clothing. You wear them right now. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes, just in case someone happens to ask me on a date. Behold! I like your body, though. I like your body, too. Yeah, what do you think of my secret style? Cool, <laughs> Basketball shoulder pads always just they crack me up. I love it. No! A genuine compliment! <laughs> However, you, didn't, you don't truly really understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid! The mistake won't escalate any further unless you find my secret. But that won't happen! Holding my hand so I'll tell you the answer. No! I must resist! Aw. Human souls are stronger than monster souls. But the souls of our shoes are, on the other hand, are about the same. <laughs> There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and perseverance. This shirt didn't originally say cool, but I improved it. Expect it. All clothing articles can be improved this way. I see, I see. You like crossing my biceps with a floating heart. But who doesn't? My hat? My hat. My hat! <laughs> Yay, I get a present! Well, then you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present just for you. Open it. Yay, I got spaghetti! Do you know what this is? Yes, it's spaghetti! My favorite food! Spaghetti. That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Yep. Right. But also wrong! This ain't any plain old pasta! This is an artisan drop! So good spaghetti! Find me age in the open cast! Uh... Then quit by me, Master Chef Papyrus! Human, it's time to end this! There's no way this can go any further! That's awesome. You take a small bite. Your face reflexes, reflexively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. Let me try. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. That's... Um, it's, it's indescribable. Oh, God. Sands was right when he said he might need to be able to make something edible by next year. Ugh. Perhaps I love you, but... Uh, what a passionate expression! You must really love my cooking, and by extension, me! That's, 
Oh, <laughs> you're so cute! Maybe even more than I do! Ugh! Ugh! No! Human, it's clear now. You're madly in love with me. Um... I wouldn't say madly, but I do like you. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. I, um, boy, is it hot in here or is it just me? Oh, shoot. Human, I, I am sorry. I don't like you the way you like me. Romantically, I mean. I mean, I tried very hard to. I thought that because you flirted with me, I was supposed to go on a date with you. Then on the date, feelings would blossom forth. I would be able to match your passion for me. But alas, I, the great papyrus, have failed. Oh, Pabs! Don't say that! I feel just the same as before. And instead, by dating you, I've only drawn you deeper into your intense love for me! A dark prison of passion with no escape. How could I have done this to my dear friend? No! Wait! That's wrong! I can't budge anything! Human, I'll help you through these trying times! I'll keep being your cool friend! And act like this now all never happened. After all, you are very great. It would be tragic to lose your friendship. So please, don't cry because I won't kiss you. Because I don't even have lips. But I do! I just give you a peck on the cheekbone. It's cute. And hey, someday I'll find someone as great as me. Well, no, that's not true. <laughs> yeah, I won't be able to find someone as great as Papyrus. But I'll help you settle for second best. <laughs> okay, bye, Paps. Oh, you're back? Oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime, platonically. Well, gotta go. <laughs> Bye, Pappy. Okay. I think that about wraps it up for this episode of Undertale. I'm just gonna go quickly and save. Um, so that way, like, all of the progress is done and then I can keep going. The next section should be Waterfall and Undyne. <laughs> so yeah, that'll be interesting. I hope you guys are gonna look forward to that. But for now, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like what you saw, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe to become a Dazzling today. I really love this game, and I really hope you guys are enjoying my playthrough of it. So anyway guys, I'm Arya, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye! -bye!